Today we're going to demonstrate our technique for ACL repair with internal brace. This is some previous updates from our previous technical video uh, with our gained experience. So today this is a patient with a proximal ACL tear. You can see here the stump is well preserved. We're starting to debride this area, we debride the wall femorally, and then we're going to microfracture the femoral wall to stimulate healing. In the area of entry, we'll make a slightly larger microfracture hole. We'll use a spade tip from the medial portal. We'll go all the way through bicortically. We'll measure roughly where we pop through so we have an idea of flipping the button. Then we take a passing suture out the lateral portal. And then we're going to do a 3.0 bowl guide. This is a cannulated drill. You can see we're grabbing this out of the lateral portal again to avoid any suture tangling. This is a fiber ring, 35 millimeter. We're using a shoulder scorpion here to get better bites. We take a bite from each side. We have the lower bite out the medial portal and the higher bite out the lateral portal. This allows for ease of passage. We've already passed the first fibering through the tie rope device. Now we're passing the second fibering through the tie rope device and we're checking to make sure these slide. We're going to steps two and three, as you can see on the website. Following this, we've engaged the entire tight rope device. We're passing it up into the tunnel. You can see the fiber tape. Again, we're holding on to the fiber tape as we're doing this. You can see we flip the button, we check it on x-ray, and then we're gonna dunk the internal brace. We fixate the internal brace, and you can see here, We've retensioned the ACL. We have excellent tension of the ACL back up to the footprint, and this completes the ACL repair, and the Lockman has completely returned. Thank you.